Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Muli face, we are, we are really suffering here in Zambia. Don't worry. I think uh, by by next week uh, the opposition will be ready, and then we'll start doing politics. The politics of this uh, time is going to be so easy. Um, we, we are not going to suffer like we suffered in uh, in the hand of PF. It will be so easy that it's a baby thing. And so that's why I, I don't bother. You know, once these guys are ready. Then we come back and do the right thing. I'm watching you from Zambia. More knowledge, the king of Africa. King, past, God bless you. Watching you from Kalabo, Zambia. Things are hard here. Very, very soon, everything will be okay. Just very soon. Very, very soon. Everything will be okay. Be patient. Chimwanga Livingston, I'm watching you from Zambia. Kanange M. Castro, say, see, I want we love you in Zambia. I'm Castro. Lusaka, we suffer a lot. I know what you are going through. You know, uh, the story of Zambia, I, I'm more like a Zambian. I'm more Zambian than so many Zambians. So I know exactly what you guys are going through. And I am part of it. You know, not even part of it. I am the head of it. It's only a fool that will wake up and say, see, one did not do anything for us. It's only a fool that will do that. On Sunday, depending on the time that the opposition is ready i'll go live and i'll talk politics and in that politics i want to tell you that more than fifteen thousand people will turn in more than fifteen thousand people will turn in and it will start at 9 p.m exactly now i want president etch president edgar lung president fred member President Calabar. At the same time, let them all go live. And including praise singers, those ones hungry, suffering and smiling, those ones, let all of us go live. And let's talk. Let's do campaign. Let's see who will have the largest audience. That's how you know, that's how you measure popularity and influence. <laughs> it's not a, it's not a, by talk 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 talk. I uh, see I want, I uh, see I uh, see I uh, No, let's go. I even see in the groups, in the pages. I uh, see I uh, want is this, see I uh, want is that. I don't, I don't respond. I know we are, I know we are, we are heading to. And this is um, where I've been before. So it's a game that I've played before. I know it. It's a psychological game. And I'm sound psychologically. When you come to psych, psycholo, psychological game, it's me. <laughs> I would love you, see, I want to come and stand as president in Zambia. <laughs> so it's a psychological game. This is my food, it is my psychology. That put HH in power. You we you can you can deny it, but let me I'm I'm coming back 
when politics start and telling you that this person will be the president now then we compare if i if i manage again to do it the second time then i want you to believe me that hh1 was not a mistake how many times did he lose the election he lost the election when imagine a sitting president died sata died and a nobody, somebody who never neared presidency, a somebody who Eddie Galungu, who was even a nobody in Zambia, came and stood against a church and won the election. When he had so much power to win the election, when he had everything to win the election, he didn't win until I came in. I laugh. I I laugh at you guys who don't know what happened on the day of election or what happened during election or during the campaign period. But very soon you will start knowing. And I understand this thing. I am a politician, born politician, psychologically sound politician. That's why I don't respond to so many things. I just allow things to work, to go, to go. Now UPN the state is they, are, they want me to exhaust, to say things that I want to say. When I'm talking, they will be making correction. When I'm talking, they'll be making correction. When it's by the time it's towards 2026, 20, they would have made a lot of correction. But I'm not like that. That's why I'm telling you, I'm psychologically sound. I know this game. When I hit, you don't, you wouldn't know where to touch. That's how I hit PF. By the time before I started fighting Eddie Galungu, there are People who believe that Eddie Galungu was Messiah, who believe that Eddie Galungu was humble. I mean, there are people who believe that Eddie Galungu was sent from God. I remember the first day I did broadcast against Eddie Galungu. Hey, the insult I received. Now I'm not even receiving insult because I only receive few insults from uh, Western province. Those are few people that are. Say, oh, see, I want this. Oh, see, I want that. I, I look at that. I laugh. That is not insult. I received insult from PF. I received insult from the people of Zambia. I mean, uncountable insult. When I finish broadcast, I read it. I say, ha, ah, where are these guys learning insult from? But because I know that this is politics, insult is part of it. I don't put it at heart. I proceed. As I continued, people's eyes started opening. Because this is information. I told you when I came to over here, over a Nemo state, this is one of the smallest states in Nigeria. When I came here and preached my gospel first, the type of gospel that I preach, you, you know that it's different. I preach reality and I support our culture. So when you preach this type of thing, people will be scared of you. They will say, ha! Ah, this is Satan. This person is against Bible. We are six in number. Only six in number. When I finished preaching that thing, I even lost some of them. I continue preaching. But this is consistency. The more I preach, the more people eyes started opening. The more people's brain started opening. The more people's Psych started opening. What they used to see as white, they begin to see it black. What they used to see as black, they begin to see. Today, as we speak, I lead the single largest congregation here. If that's why I, I'm not shaking. So when I when I started it, people were shaking. Ah, that's my. You what he said? You will go to hell. I remember one day I went to radio. I preached about it. Hey, the calls I received. Ah, Jesus, this one is Antichrist. This one. But today, radio people are now calling me. Come and educate our people. That is how we did it. Or Tedigalung. It's how we did it. So the, when you continue exposing things, talking things, showing people reality, they are seeing it. Those that don't believe, gradually they start believing. Gradually they start believing. President H.H. won election with a million votes, or even less than a million votes. Now, things are not okay. 
the promises that we are made to the people are not doing politics, forgive me, but the promises that are made to the people, are they fulfilled? How many of those 2.5 million people that came out to vote, how many of them are happy today? If the members of the party, this is the first time in the history of Zambia, please check your history. I'm not talking. Check your history. The first time in the history of Zambia where within a space of two years, the people that supported the government have turned against the government. It has never happened before. So how many people have been hurt by this government? Members. There are uncountable who believe that when we take over power, things would be okay for us. As we speak today, they are crying. These are members, so not, not general public, not people that used to go to the market and buy milli meal at 100, 130. Now they go and buy it at 400. You think that they are fools? You think they are fools? I'm so honored today to receive the president of Botswana, His Excellency Magwesi E. K. Masisi. Wow, I'm so honored to have you in the broadcast today. God bless you, His Excellency. So, how many people, how many people do you think are crying today? So, I don't want to do politics. I promise you, not now. I'm waiting for the opposition to settle down. I'm waiting for the opposition to put themselves in order. And then we remove a church. As simple as ABC. A church will go like this. I swear. So it's, it's as simple as that. I don't, I don't even want to talk about that today. The reason why that must be done is that a church don't want to learn. A church must go and ask question from presidents like this president of Botswana that is watching or many other presidents in Africa, even Obasanjo here, ask them how is politics done? Politics is a nat nat national cake. Politics is a national cake. It's a cake that everybody in the nation must eat. You don't just hold it like this. All the contracts is for you and your friends. All the money is for you and your friends. All the resources is for you and your friends. I don't even want to talk about that because those I, I like to talk them with evidence. And the, when when the time comes, when we are ready, then you you'll be seeing those things. It's not how poly politics is you eat. There is no one, I said it before, there is no one on earth. There is no one on earth that become a president to serve his people. It's a lie. There is no one on earth that become a president to serve his people. It's a lie. You must understand politics. Politics, when you are in opposition, you fight to take over power. When you take over power, it is your time to eat. It is your time to eat. While you are eating, those people that help you to take power, remember to eat with them. The musicians, the cadres, the securities, Everyone that supported you, remember to eat with them. Because your time will expire. Another person will take over the national cake from you. And when he's eating, he will eat with, with his own people. That is why it's called national cake. It rotates. Everyone must eat it. Not you are eating alone. Eh, we are not here to eat. Oh, we are here to work. What work is there? It's to eat. When you finish eating, other people will come. They will eat. They will eat with their own people. You have your own people. While you were in opposition, you had your own people. The people that believed in your vision. The people that were willing to die for you. 
the people that loved you, when you take over power, you eat with them. You eat with them. When is your time expire? Other person will come, like now, Fred member has his own people. His time will come to rule. When he's ruling, he will remember the people he worked with. After his own, another person will come. Uka has his own people. Their time has, is coming. Calabar has his own people. Their time is coming. There are people that are having sleepless nights because of them right now. When they win election, they abandon those people and start taking care of the people that have been eating. Remember where this war started? It started with Chishimba A person that has been eating in government since God knows when. HH abandoned the people that worked with him to go and take care of people that are already rich. People that started eating before anything. All the musicians that sings for UPND, they are poor. Zambia is crying. When Zambia is crying, Nigeria is crying. That is why Kenneth Kaunda, Dr. Kenneth Kaunda, is being respected today all over Africa. Why? Because he stood for Africa. He didn't just stand for Zambia. He stood and fought for South Africa. He stood and fought for Nigeria. He fought for every country. Why don't you be like him? When you say, talk about Nigeria, talk about Nigeria, uh, talk about Tunubu, uh, talk about Tunubu, why don't you help us talk about him? You don't follow me. Those of you that follow me know that Nigerian government don't have it easy with me. If you follow this page, you know that I don't segregate. I talk about anything that will help Nigeria, anything that will help Africa, anything that will help Zambia. That's what I talk about. And as a matter of fact, talk about Nigeria. In your country where you are, you're always talking about Israel, the God of Israel. In fact, you talk about Jesus. Every day Jesus is in your lips. It's Jesus from Zambia. Answer me. The Jesus you call every day, Jesus, 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 is Jesus from Zambia. Every day, Satan, Satan, Satan is a liar, Satan is a liar. Is Satan from Zambia? Is Satan from Chilabombe or Kitwe or Ndola? They are not from Zambia, but you talk about them. You talk about so many things about so many other countries. It's very important. I'm helping you. UPND, though the war has not started, time is coming when you will need me. When you leave power in 2026, you will still need me. When the next government will misbehave, you will still need me. Like PF. Today, PF need me. Oka need me. SP need me. Calabar need me. I am the only person that know the weakness of UPND. I am the only person that will force them out of there. Not Oka, Oka, this, that, that. No, no. Election is not about uh, what you see or going to stand in the queue to vote. When I come in the next broadcast, I will tell you how election was won in Zambia and how election is won. Don't fool yourself. I know some, ah, see, I want, you, you say, do you vote? What is vote? <laughs> you are in Africa. What do you what is vote? Yours is to vote, but your vote don't count. This is Africa. There are people that decide who becomes a president. And you see in 2026, I swear you will see. Once is it not what I told you about uh, about a church? When everybody was saying HH is finished, HH is finished, I came and told you that if HH don't win election, I would drop my gun because I know the game. <laughs> so if I keep quiet, like today, I decide to go quiet. I don't talk again. I leave politics. I'm telling you that UPND can rule Zambia till 50 years. Because all this opposition, Oka, SP, uh, Calabar, they don't know. They don't know anything that happens. They don't know it. 
But for the sake of people of Zambia, there must be change. And I am the one that will make it happen. I will come and give you proof how election was won. And the Tell you that this is going to happen again. If you want to gather the whole, by the time the election was going on, how many Chinese did the PF uh, employ to safeguard the system? How many did it work? Leave that in. It's my, it's my job. I, I'm not going to talk again about this until we, opposition is done and they are ready. And then I will come and tell you to say, Politics has started. The day that I would declare war against HH, I swear, HH will not sleep. Ask Eddie Galungu. Eddie Galungu will tell you that uh, this is not a joke. The day the opposition will be ready, say, okay, see you one. This is the person. Help us with this person. That day, there will, there will not be peace again. UPND will divide into two like this. UPND, like this. I'm telling you from the minister, it would divide like this. HH don't even have support in UPND. I mean, it don't have support. Forget about all these ones. You know when somebody has support. When Eddie Galungu was in power, when he visited the secretariat, hey, <laughs> You will know that this guy has support. HS support has died in UPND. Nothing. They are talking to me. Most of the ministers. Most of them. Most of the big guys in UPND. Are, we are talking always. I mean, how can a whole minister sit at his office? A permanent secretary will carry foul and go to community house to go and discuss with the president. My father, so I see a one is not God. No, I'm not God. God does not vote. God does not even talk. When we start politics, God go quiet. <laughs> I don't worry. Eddie Galungu, when I started with him, didn't he call men of God? Eh? National prayer. Did it work? It didn't work. <laughs> don't leave this thing I don't even push me to that as for now time is coming for that this is DJ Mutati exclusive alright that's all for you today lovely viewers if you did enjoy the video please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.